All right, all right. Just getting everything set up. Let's get the YouTube chat up in here as well. All right, looking good on Twitch. Mic check, mic check. Okay, got some. All right, looking good on YouTube. Let me get some comments. <laughs> you guys. All right. What up, y'all? All right. So today, yeah, nothing too exciting. Uh, I just want to go through some PRs. Actually, let me do this. All right. What's up, bro? All right. So this is what we got planned for today. Again, nothing uh, too exciting. Just need to review a bunch of uh, open PRs, mainly from website. And then, yeah, I'll go through what we're working on. Yeah, I need to write some tickets up, pretty boring stuff. And then gonna be writing a release plan and then have product meeting later on. And then after that, just gonna record some videos. Also got my chat over here, so. All right, so PR review time. And also, let me shift this over so I can read your guys' comments as well. Has he been streaming or did I just start streaming? I started streaming last night. So, all right. Apparently, a lot of people thought I was dead. So, <laughs> it's interesting. Man, I'm going to get easily distracted with all of these. So let's hop on over to GitHub. All right. Reviewed this one earlier. Mac instructions. What do we got here? Okay. So yes, this PR looks to be for this. Let me show you guys. So on the download page, whenever you download for Mac, that there's additional step in here for some security or verified app. Okay, so this is pretty old since it uh, was here since November 9th. I'm not sure if it's an issue still. Where's the hat? Uh, no hat today, although I probably should put one on. I like wearing a winter hat with uh, my headset because it flakes and it kind of gets all over me. But it's a little warm in here right now, so I don't know. Hat or no hat? What do you think? We got ball cap or winter hat or just straight up my head. All right. There's one vote for winter hat. Okay, let's check this out. Apple cannot check for a malicious software when you're downloading this. And this is interesting too, because we are uh, certified.
pirate hat. <laughs> nice big head. Okay. I guess you like my uh, straight up head. Mm-hmm. Yeah, this should be, uh... Tutorial on Unity. I need a mod as well for this to prevent against these spammers. So this is just a, a stream, and I'm just going to be working on the digital currency network. Nothing special, nothing planned. Just figured if anyone wants to kind of tag along. Okay. So in order for this app to open without it coming from the app store and without needing to do any special actions, which we do now, we essentially right click and hit open. You would need to get the app notarized to developer process, an automated process. So I thought that this is what we did. Uh, it always happens, apps not download from the app store. Okay. Yeah, since I did go through uh, like Apple's developer program and bought license to get notarized, whatever it was. Okay, so it seems like this is the correct solution. So, uh, not this, this is... Okay, let's add it in and okay, since there's no related issue, is this related? Could you say, uh, yeah, maybe it is. All right, so this fixes issue number Hmm, is this related? So this issue is Apple cannot check for malicious software, but it doesn't really describe the fix since it's still not checking, but they are related, so. Four, three, one, actually I can just paste this. Oh wait, this is the account manager, so this is different repo altogether. So let me just create an issue for this, since it should be linked. special instructions. All right, let me submit this. I 
And also, what was this original issue? Look like none. I'm upgrading my laptop to Big Sur as well. Can't see the letters, this and that. Okay. Of this. Too big and it's hard for me to read, so. Thank you for the tutorials. You're welcome. Glad they could help. All right, so we have this newly created issue, 114, and I'll just say this fixes 114, which it should pick up, but it didn't. So I can just do this. Beautiful. And now I just want to check this out to make sure it's all prettier and everything. So I'm going to go to my website repo. Pull it down, and if you guys don't know how to do this on a web store, whenever you are working on an open source project as the maintainer and someone submits a PR, you can go to VCS, get, and then you can do Volt view pull request. And then if you don't have it already, it gives you this little tab. My laptop's updating right now, by the way, and its fan is pretty loud. But anyways, let's get back to here. So this uh pull request is from zeus lawyer deal mac instructions so we can probably just find that zeus lawyer mac instructions then you click this and then you can check out branch and then you can check out a tracking branch and create and now this should be good so npm install let me see what's up with that and let me also all right is that big enough for you guys I can't really do anything about this text. Yo, yo, what up? What up? Hey, everyone. Okay, a couple people joined in now. All right, so I can't do anything about the text on the side. But it, it looks like these dependencies are just old. And let me go to this file. And what was this for? So source containers download index. All right, so let me run this actually. So that bad boy's booting up, can get rid of this. And another thing that I like to do, is if we do npm run prettier, then we have a npm script that essentially goes through all these files and just uh, formats them correctly. For some reason it keeps formatting tsconfig. This is actually interesting. If any of you guys know what's going on with this, let me show you. Uh, if you do git and roll back, this is the fastest way I compare them, is that whenever I run prettier, it changes uh, JSX react to react hyphen JSX. And I'm not sure why, because this is a tsconfig. I don't know why prettier keeps writing that. Or maybe it's my IDE and it just happens while I'm running right here. Wait, you guys can't see the code? Can you guys see this? Man, this is kind of annoying. I have to scroll on each one. Can't stick around, but Bucky, you're the reason I have six figure job right now. Thank you for that. You are welcome, Josh. Code isn't clear on 720p. Okay, let's bump this up. Let's bump it way up. Let me actually, okay. The quality needs to be better, not bigger text. Uh, is this not 1080p? All right, let's take a little break and uh, Just make the stream. All right. So Acrim says, no, it's not 1080. Okay. So, so this is my second time streaming. So how would I, you look like an egg. Hmm. Interesting. All right. No, it's not 1080. 
So I probably have to restart my stream and make it 1080A. Highest is 720. All right. So I'll be back in a second with uh, an HD stream. 